hello guys welcome back in Snow channel so guys in this video we will learn how you can use the sp component on schedule so for that we can say i already created a project and now i can in the plus button of the component so let's add so the what is the sp the sp is a uh, kind of programming that we can save the data manually if we need if we not need it will be not safe okay guys okay so let's start the video that uh, now it is you can see it will be asking you that enter the component name then it will be asked the enter the file name. so the component name or the file name is not dependent which type file you want to save it here okay it's not dependent so let's give some name so we use sp so then just click on add so here you can see it will automatically add so let's come a view let's see what is give us here it will be give a get data key key data key with value and remove data key so here it gives us a three type of uh, block that one is the get data key another one is the seed data key and the another one is remove data key so what is this? so let's first from in the get data key the get data key is guys when we are add something in our sp component and we give it a direction to save it the data then this, how we can use that uh, coding if we need or that information in our future as like so we can use that block so i show you how you can use that so let's add a edit text and give that text it in sp and let's add a blue girl and uh, let's also put this one oh shit guys i use the linear so we can give it here so here our text view Add a blue gun to use it at last. But for now, we must make that one. Okay, so here we first add a save uh, button to save. Okay, let's come on the on button one click. So let's now come on the second block that is seed data key then so guys seed data key is the uh, kind of block that how uh, we can give the block uh, files as like guys which file you want to save in the sp our sp component and what is the name we give the name in here okay and the uh, value is from it mean the guys value is our edit text for now which file or which a picture or something files we want to save in here so let's add it we now use the edit text so it will be data collect from the edit text let's keep it as p and the key name is uh, the, it is the key of the release key that we can separate it just think guys if we use uh, one and two and three uh, seed data key then uh, the computer can't be um, if we use like similar name that save data save data save data again it will be not counting the number of the save data properly we cannot use it properly so they give it a key that save data key so it is a you want to give every time a special key that it will be not similar type of another name so it will be not crashed or it will be not deleted the data or, or not count the your file data what you give here so let's add it here sp okay uh, now on the activity we use only just the on the text view one. so it now we see that guys so let's see text so now we see the text from the share 
did that is SP and you give that in SP. The SP also from it then the uh, also just similar type of node that guys you can move to some save the data in future as like guys I write now in that how are you guys now if I close the app it will be gone that data but if I use the, uh, save with the SP components it will be not uh, removed or not uh, remove the data when I exit the app okay in future when I come back in the app it will show me automatically the file or my save thing if I code as like that okay so let's add a new group on that here delete is guys uh, give us the new data key the new data key is mean that what we save in the SP component it will be removed the key okay it means that we not need just guys think that now if we write that SP uh, in the SP component data key uh, that uh, subscribe my channel okay and after the future you not need the uh, data you need, to, you need to add something but we can delete that uh, future file data so that is the uh, block that if you click that one it will be deleted the key with the sp so that's why we use the sp code and uh, it is to use the unit key so it will be uh, delete the position in the uh, position at correct rate okay so that's all in this for the shallow sp compartment so let's run the app and let's try how it work so guys our app is done so let's check so here you can see the text view now is not visible and it don't have any data so let's give a data that high so if i write high and close the app it will be not into anything in future when i come back again it will be not showing anything so guys if i write high and click with the save key Save. Okay, guys, let's see what happened. Guys, the linear tree seems to have the linear tree to be not showing us the attacks one. You can see that, guys, it will be not showing the. Yeah, guys you can see now it will be work that it will be guys not showing the real time okay but if we just see that guys let's write something as guys here uh, try and now it will be saved it so if I remove and come again you can see the data is now here so if I again close the app or something to else it will be not delete the data it will be save the data in sp so let's delete the key so if we click on delete so now you can see that it will have the key or the data you can see guys it is very easy but we need to fix some bug in here that after them saving it will be need to show it live and one by one to so we upgrade the app and last in this video so that's all in this video please like share and subscribe to the bell icon if you like the video bye bye